Right, first off, real quick, big thanks for 500 subs. Um, you know, we're halfway there now, halfway there to monetization, basically. The watch time hours are getting there. They're at about 2.3 thousand now. So we need 1.7 thousand watch time hours and then 500 subs. And we're sorted. Well, I think 497 now. So big thanks for that. If you want to help towards it, make sure you drop a sub, stick around on the channel. I'd appreciate it. However, today... What we're doing obviously team of the season so far bundesliga is out and today i'm going to be showing how you can grind slash make the uh the upgrades cheaply first off obviously i did the uh the league ones last week and if we just look at who i packed we did indeed get the karen benzema i don't know how much benzema is sat at, at the minute However, he he's a, he's a fair chunk of coins. He is indeed a fair chunk of coins. If we go and look at him real quick. Uh, da, 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 da. If one could show, that would be nice. But I probably spent about 200 to 250k on uh, making these upgrades. And as you can see, people are bidding on him for 700k. So... I made back my coins and made profit, technically. Obviously, yes, he's untradeable, but I can use him in my team, so it's calm. But, the way that most methods start, is the most boring thing. It's opening the bronze packs, no one likes it, everyone hates it, but you gotta do it, you, gotta, you have to do it, you have to do it. Um, obviously, once again, there's the three methods, there's, uh, you can either send all into the club, put them all use them all for the next step or you can sell the uh like the major league ones or you can keep all the league ones and not use them in the second step at all and then do the league SBC grind however well, i mean the way that i did it last week i'm not doing it again this week because i'm basically broke and i don't want to i don't want to put myself through to rinse in the club again but Obviously, you've got the bronze upgrade, so after you've opened, say, 50k, 30 to 50k's worth of bronze upgrades, you can go and put these bronze upgrades, bronze players into bronze upgrades, and bronze upgrades to the silver upgrades, silvers to the golds, then you get the rare players from the gold upgrades, and also you get a very high chance of packing someone good. Well, not very high, but you get the chance of packing someone good. Like I know that I packed obviously Ronaldo I got from my rewards, I got from the two rare gold players pack. I've had Parejo from these. My mate has got Lewandowski from these. So they're very useful. However, in my opinion that's probably not the best way to go ahead and do it anymore. Obviously you can do that. If you've already got the bronze players, you want to put them into bronze upgrades and then rinse club out for these Bundesliga. You go bronze upgrades, silver upgrades, to gold upgrades, and then the gold upgrades into the Bundesliga upgrades that are coming out 6 p.m. on Tuesday. I believe that the you know the 11 rare Bundesliga ones. I believe that this week they are going to be 81 plus two 81 plus players. So they have kind of taken it down from last week. Um, however. I don't think there's too many high-rated Bundesliga players left. And obviously, there's uh, people are still going to want to go broke on them because some of these cards are absolutely mental. However, the way that I'd recommend doing it is to prepare for these 25 ks because in my opinion, the 81 pluses aren't going to be worth it. If we go and look at, if we go and look at, say, Bauman, we will look at, he is already at, what, about 1.8? 1.9, there's none for 1.9. This is 12 o'clock on Monday, Monday, yeah, 12 o'clock on Monday. And already you can see that these cards are about 2k. I'll give another example. Um, let's go with, we'll go with Lars Bender. Um, he is not 2k, there's none on the market. Uh, there is Bebu as another example. He is just under 2k is about 1.9 so these cards are too heavily invested in already so you can't go for these they're not they ain't gonna be worth it you can snipe 
but in my opinion they're just it's just not going to be worth it so what i would do is i'd wait until the uh 25k comes out and well actually no i wouldn't i'd wait until monday morning and in my opinion you go through you pick up all these and you go on the side you go you t in my opinion you take 11 players the the chem will be 45 chemistry so you need 45 chemistry it will most likely be a 442 that that's i think that's what it was for the past two weeks 442 you need 45 chemistry so in my opinion what i would do if i was doing these i go ahead go into squad selector um and then go ahead and go create a new squad then go rares now once you've created this squad called rares what you do is obviously set it to 442 and you want to just go ahead look through here put it on concept players and you want to just go through and see what rares you can get what rares are there that are going to be cheap and get you the chemistry now obviously you want to probably stay clear of the major league ones um, obviously this guy is always useful you can go with him you're basically looking for any cards that are under probably 800 coins you can pick them up for if you can get them for under 800 coins then i'd say that that's a uh, that's good so obviously if we go here i actually know that what i did last week was i used eredivisie um i went eredivisie right back i went this guy and then put dumfries in i then also went with this martinez uh, left back i went and got haps and at this point here you can go ahead and use falc i believe it is yep falc there then there is a another danish i think it's danish and uh it is this guy yeah they strongly into each other you can then go ahead here uh, left mid you can always use like a promise for example promise is probably going to be a bit too expensive so we could oh we got brunette in there yeah we are no we haven't so we could go with uh bruh no um there we go put him in these strong links uh, right mids who've we got uh, right mids from where visa obviously as you can see here basically what i'm doing is i'm just making the team um right wing is there any right no uh, um, center mids nope cdm no Camp. Uh, yeah, there is actually a Van der Beek. We can use him. And now, as you can see here, we're at 56 chemistry without putting these strikers in. So if we go ahead and put two random uh, strikers in, we'll go with obviously there. Uh, they were both Serie A ones. Those ones. If we go with them two, then bang, there you go. 59 chemistry. So it's got a lot of leg room. So obviously, if the formation does change. You're still going to be sorted but there you have it there's a team you go out and buy i'd buy 10 of these if you, well it depends how many you want to do really you go ahead thursday morning and you just go on a sign on these uh after obviously after you've opened your weekend league rewards and that and uh yeah you just go assigned on all these you know go go broke on them well don't go broke on them i wouldn't recommend that do buy as buy as many as you want basically but you just got to remember that you need to filter to what you want and does i can't tell you a set amount of coins that you need to go and spend you need to spend the coins that you want to spend if that makes sense so there we have it we go ahead go for all these and just keep them all on the unassigned if you don't know what unassigned means you buy you buy 10 one of them gets sent to your club the other nine get sent to get just stuck on the, on the uh, unassigned thing which is basically where they just kind of sit on the menu. Uh, you know when you open a pack and you have to press RT to get them into the club? That's what they do on the menu. And the way to access them is you just go and open a bronze pack. The bronze pack don't actually open, so you don't use, lose your coins, and then you sort it. So, obviously, 
once again real quick obviously you can do the bronze upgrades and the silver upgrades and the gold upgrades but no come out but even then i don't think that's the most efficient way to do it if you're doing league sbc grind then you can obviously use the dead players to put them into there so that is a good way to do it if you go in like that because that is going to be efficient however if you're not doing the league sbc grind i wouldn't recommend this i'd scrap all that bundesliga rares are too expensive so you want to prepare for the 25k pack ones and when the 25k pack ones come out you want to have a team like this like i've done go on assigned on them um you know to spend as many as you want you can buy to, you can buy 10 of each player you can buy 20 of each player and you're sorted but obviously i've put this video out earlier than i did last week because the earlier people prepare the better in my opinion but obviously you know you don't want to be sitting there with a unassigned trade pile for like years and years so but yeah um that's about it for this oh one other thing when they do come out obviously when the 25k's come out you've got nine non-rare golds they go into the gold upgrades accompanied by another two random golds that you can get for 350 coins easy bangers and the rares go into the 81 pluses and then well the 81 pluses will come out the Bundesliga 11 rares 50 chemistry I believe it is but they're never really never really a problem because you've all they're all Bundesliga players in it so you can if you're struggling to get the chemistry on that I'm sorry but I don't know what you're doing but there you go there you have it so if you enjoyed drop a like drop a sub all that good stuff and hopefully I can see you in the next one boys peace